So what's up guys, it's TrueZMC here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can get yourself some custom cool animals in Minecraft console edition. Without further ado guys, let's get into today's video. If you guys do say that before this this you know video does start officially guys, um, you know there are a lot of fireworks out right now because I, I think it's bonfire night or something or whatever but I just know that there's a lot of fireworks. If you do hear random popping guys, don't just be like, Drew's MC, what's that popping in the background? It is some random fireworks, guys. So, um, <clears throat> that is, the, you know, that is, that is the, you know, just popping in the background. So, as you guys do know, we all do enjoy Minecraft. And we do enjoy playing with, you know, the standard mods. But sometimes it can get a little bit boring, which is why I make these videos to show you guys how to spice up your world. So, what you want to do, guys, is if you want to get some custom animals, you basically want to want to get yourself the animals first. So, you know, we need to get ourselves polar bear and ocelot. Um... And this is really simple as well guys, I've made a couple of other videos on this and this doesn't always work guys, so I just want to say that it doesn't always work, but sometimes it does guys, and when it does, it actually does look really cool guys. So, I'll show you guys, for example, we can actually change the polar bear into, you know, a panda, we can actually change this ocelot into like a different sort of tiger cat, we can actually change the wolf into something else, and you know, the donkey always usually stays the same. The, the skeleton that actually looks is that that that's a child skeleton horse and then we've got pig and we've got sheep so all you need to do guys and some of you guys might be like well drew's mc that that's pretty obvious but it isn't guys because um you know a lot of people don't tend to do this which is why i make these videos guys and if you guys said you know well drew's mc i kind of knew this already just you know then um the video is not for you then is it but yeah like i was saying guys all you need to do is you know change your texture pack guys and when you change your texture pack it basically unlocks certain you know mobs in certain texture packs for example i'll show you guys i'll switch now and as you guys can see over here in the Chinese mythology texture pack guys, we have ourselves a panda. So you can get yourself a panda in the Chinese mythology texture pack guys, if you just switch to that one. And then as you guys can see over here, we can get ourselves like, I think this is kind of like a leopard. But like I said, you know, a wolf as well guys, it turns into, you know, what's this? A fox guys. So as you guys can see, it turns into a fox, which I personally think guys, it's really cool rather than having, you know, the standard default mobs. You can just, you know, switch texture pack and get yourself some new sort of cool, cool mobs because something that not a lot of people do guys and there's actually a lot of texture pack secrets guys that i need to make a video on because there's so many uses for every different texture pack like the other day guys i went into around you know five different worlds guys and there were so many unique things in texture packs that most people don't realize guys because you know not every mob changes guys so i'll show you for example you know um you know let's see a uh, sheep a sheep is still pretty much a sheep although it doesn't look like it and a pig guys is still pretty much like a wild boar which is technically still a pig so it doesn't always always change guys which is why i kind of made this video to show you which mobs do change and which mobs do look a lot better so you guys can see it actually just looks like a panda guys it doesn't look like that much different than anything else so you know i'll be showing you guys some you know more and more secrets because there's so many secrets guys about like minecraft console that like the majority of people don't know so i'm going to show you you guys some other secret animals as well so as you guys can see in the greek mythology texture pack this kind of becomes like a baby lion and yeah it's just really really cool which is why you guys should definitely explore different texture packs to see which animals <laughs> So as I was saying guys, this, you know, does become a baby lion and also it does become a baby lion. And this is why guys, you should definitely explore the other texture packs just to see what animals change and what animals don't. So as you guys see, this now looks like a sort of brown sort of dog sort of thing. Because it is a wolf, it's technically a dog if you know what I mean. But, you know, you know, sometimes it does change dramatically. And this does change into a brown bear. And like a lot of texture packs, it does change into a brown bear. And a brown bear and a polar bear are pretty different if you ask me guys. So... It's definitely something that I would recommend you guys trying if you guys definitely want to get yourself your own custom animals. And another thing, guys, is that, you know, in the new texture pack as well, guys, the portal color changes as well. So that's just something that, like, most people don't realize. Most people just think, you know, it's just the textures and, you know, the standard stuff stay the same. Like, pigs are always pigs. You know, um, you know, polar bears are always polar bears. But they do change differently, guys, which is, I think, interesting enough for you for it to you know make you guys want to switch so i think i might end that video here today guys i know it was a short video i know it was a quick one but nonetheless guys i've got another awesome video coming for you guys tomorrow at the exact same time I upload every single day a new minecraft video and i never ever miss a day guys so